How was school today? Great. Yeah? Yeah. Teachers so far, not so much. <laughs> Logan and his uncle have a bond, and that dry sense of humor runs in the family. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just one of the things passed down in the Kettle family. But at nine years old, Logan also knows about loyalty. You follow someone's footsteps. And honor. Word of pride. There's a reason. Rangers lead the way. This must have been either whenever he joined the Rangers or whenever he, well, after he got killed. Just to remember this moment. Logan was only 15 months old when his dad, Jeff, a Green Beret, died in combat. This is a photo taken just hours before he was killed. <coughs> he was on a uh, mission yeah. to go and hunt for uh, bad guys. That's what kind of what his team did. And uh, <coughs> they he were... Ran over a landmine, right? Yeah. They were going through a dry riverbed and they had their vehicles spaced out about uh, 50 meters apart. And uh, he drove over his vehicle drove over a massive buried IED. The family buried Jeff at Arlington Cemetery, the resting place of heroes. Logan was a baby. He was there. It's been really tough. Like, I don't know what it, what it's like to have a dad and, like, everyone else in my class has a dad and, like, their dads are so great and, I bet mine was greater, but I couldn't have spent time with him. There is one thing Logan wishes he had, his dad's dress uniform jacket. Somehow, in the days after his dad's death, it disappeared, eight years ago. Clay Kettle has made it his mission to keep his brother's memory alive. He had to do something. When I was in school, I always wore my dad's Air Force jacket. It was very important to me. So Clay used his brother's service record the picture of the uniform, and painstakingly tried to recreate that jacket for his nephew. The hardest part was the Tunisian jump wings. Finally, through a Facebook post, an old classmate found the wings on eBay. Wow. After months of piecing it together, Clay presented the jacket to Logan at the family's home in College Station. I bet this looks exactly like the one I haven't seen yet. It does. I promise you he died doing what he loves. Wow. Seeing the replica of the uniform jacket brought tears to his mother's eyes. Yeah, I'm sure they would have been best friends. Army Commendation Medal, Army Achievement Medal. Clay Kettle is now medically retired after himself being injured by a roadside bomb. I have a hard time remembering what that one is. His brother is one of more than 2,000 service members killed in Afghanistan. The only one from his hometown of Texas City. Can I, like, take out this hanger and see, like, and, like, put this on? I Try think, it? I think that's what everybody wants to see, believe it or not. <laughs> it? Yeah, sure. Shoulder blades. It was an unforgettable moment for his grandma, too. He was the best dad. He loved him a lot. I mean, if he wasn't in this world, we, we wouldn't be standing here today. Him and men like him. Logan's uncle still holds out hope of finding the real jacket. But in the meantime, there is comfort in knowing his nephew has the next best thing. Along with mementos to honor a hero. My dad was a true hero. His dad.